Hello and welcome. In honor of Women's History Month, in this video, we will be learning about the life of Valerie Thomas, an American inventor. Valerie Thomas was born on February 8, 1943 in Maryland. She always had an interest in STEM since she was a little girl. She would always watch her father work on electronics and imaging. At the time, females partaking in STEM was not common. She got the book, The Boy's First Book on Electronics, and took great interest in it. Since her father had similar interests, she asked if he would help her with the projects in the book. However, he did not. Valerie Thomas attended an all-girls school where science classes were not considered important. However, after graduating from that school in 1961, she attended Morgan State University, where she finally had the opportunity to partake in STEM. She was one of two women who majored in physics, and she graduated in 1964 with the highest honors. With that, she began working for NASA in 1964 as a mathematician slash data analyst. She worked on the Landsat project, which was the first satellite to send multispectral images of Earth from space in order to study Earth's land masses. Her role in the project was to manage the image processing systems. Her creativity doesn't stop there though. When attending a STEM event in 1976, the illusion of a light bulb transmitting another image of itself caught her attention. She began experimenting and was able to produce a similar illusion. This led to her invention of the illusion transmitter which uses two concave mirrors to create a 3D image. She got a patent for it in 1980. She invented the illusion transmitter with high hopes of it being used more in the future. So far, NASA and other scientists use this today for experiments. This can also lead to a future of being able to watch television in 3D without special glasses, kind of like a holograph. Valerie Thomas retired from NASA in 1995, where she was very successful in projects and positions held. Still alive today, she now teaches and partakes in STEM activities and especially supports and encourages women in STEM. To quote her, strides have been made to encourage more females to consider entering the science and engineering fields. There are special STEM programs in which girls are participating, books for girls about female role models, and hands-on competitions and other activities in which girls are being successful. I hope this video encourages you to take the information Valerie Thomas said and the work she performed to take action in getting more women involved in STEM. May she be an inspiration forever. Thank you for watching.